Hello everyone. Welcome back to my YouTube channel Afan's Dynamics Training. In today's video we will be discussing about opportunities in Dynamics 365 sales. I will start by explaining what an opportunity is and I will walk you through multiple ways of creating opportunities and the opportunity views available within the system. So let's start by discussing what an opportunity is. An opportunity is a potential sale. Unlike leaked records, which typically contain basic information, opportunity records contain more specific information regarding the timeline, the product and services, and the potential revenue. Organizations use opportunities to forecast revenue. Now let's get into our sales hub application and work with opportunities. Now we are in our sales hub application. There are multiple ways of creating an opportunity. The first and the most common way of creating an opportunity is by qualifying a lead. So from the sitemap, let's select leads and open one of the leads. And from the command bar, let's click on qualify. And then qualify a lead. Finish. Now you can see that an opportunity record has been created. We can manually create an opportunity by selecting a new button from the command bar. On the opportunity form, the topic and the currency fields are mandatory that need to be filled. Whereas when a lead is qualified, the topic, currency and the potential customer is automatically entered. Let's fill in the details and create an opportunity record. Let's select the contact. Click on save. Now we have created an opportunity record. We can also create an opportunity by using a quick create form. Let's click on this button and go to opportunities. This will open up a quick create form where we can add minimal information and create an opportunity record. We have filled in the topic that is the mentality field and we can select the contact and click on save and close. Now we have created another opportunity record using a quick create form. Another way to create opportunities is to convert existing Dynamics 365 activities to opportunities. All activities can be converted to an opportunity, whereas in case of leads, only email activity can be converted to an opportunity. So from the sitemap, let's go to activities and open one of the activities, let's say, say task, open this and click on this and then convert to opportunity. We can select the customer over here this, and then convert. Okay. Now you can see that an opportunity record has been created through an activity. Let's go back to an opportunities table. You can also create opportunity using Excel templates. So we can download an Excel template from here and then we can fill in the details and then upload it back. We learned how to create opportunities. Now let's see what information we can capture on the opportunity form. Let's open one of the opportunity record. Under summary tab, we have information section where we can add more information regarding the customer, the budget amount and other stuff. If we scroll down, we can see that we can add more information regarding the opportunity. We have a timeline pane that provides a view of all the interactions or activities related to the record. Activities might include phone call appointments and so on. If we click on this button, we can see a list of activities that are available. We can create an activity and that activity will be linked to this record. We have an assistant pane that provides reminder about things like upcoming meetings or opportunity that are scheduled to be closed. If we scroll down, uh, we can also capture stakeholder information. The stakeholders are contacts who have uh, interest in the opportunity. We can also add sales team. They are internal team members who will be involved in converting the opportunity to sale. 
you can also add information regarding the external competitors if we move over to the product tab we can add pricing information we can select the price list and the calculation method that will be used to estimate the value of the opportunity moreover we can also add products or services that will be the part of the opportunity i will be discussing this part later as to how we can create price lists and products now let's move over to the course tab where we can create manage and track codes associated with the opportunity now let's move over to the field services tab where we can manage and schedule service activities related to the opportunity we can also upload documents uh, that can be relevant to this opportunity record under files tab these forms are highly customizable and these can be tailored as per the business requirements now let's discuss about the business process flow we have the business process flow that provides guidance throughout the sales life cycle each stage in the business process flow contains a step that needs to be completed to close an opportunity when an opportunity is created without a lead we need to identify the target accounts and contacts but if the opportunity is created through a lead qualification the information related to account and contact is automatically populated and the opportunity record is automatically advanced to the develop stage that is in our case under develop stage we have list of steps that need to be completed that is the customer need proposed solution we have to identify the stakeholders identify the competitors we can mark it as completed and then we can move over to the proposed stage under proposed stage we also have a list of steps that need to be completed it is identifying sales team develop proposal complete inter review and other steps so once all these steps are completed we can mark it as change it to completed that is already done in our case and then we can move over to the close stage under close stage we can see a list of steps that are available and when once all these steps are completed we can mark it as completed and we can change the status of the opportunity as closes one or closes lost let's select closes one we can see a dialog box where we can add more information regarding the actual revenue the competitor and the description let's change it to thousand click on okay When an opportunity is either won or lost, a resolution activity is generated which will appear under the timeline section. And we can open this record over from here. Here we can see the details why the opportunity was lost or won. Now let's discuss about the opportunity views that are available within the application. Let's go to the opportunities table. Dynamics 365 provides multiple views of opportunity data. Each view is pre-filtered to show opportunities in a different way. If we click on the view selector, we can see a list of opportunity-related views that are available within the application. With many opportunities to manage at one time, it can be challenging to stay on top of each one. With the opportunity pipeline view, you have the quick insight to where your deals are and which deals are at risk. So let's configure our pipeline view. So for that, let's go click on this and go to the advanced settings. I've already opened it. Once we are within the advanced setting, click on customize the system. Once we click on customize the system, this screen will open. Uh, under entities, look for opportunities. Let's scroll down. click on opportunities this will open up opportunities table de details and then let it open and then click on controls once we are within the controls we can see a pipeline view we can select it for web and once it is selected you can save it and once it is saved we can click on the publish button so we just published our opportunity pipeline view and we are now back in our application let's go to opportunities now we can see the opportunities pipeline view 
the top bar are all the key metrics that you want to track let's select number of deals in the pipeline and the chart will change this is the visual representation of our opportunities down there we have the editable grids we can quickly edit the details let's say we can change the ratings we can change different details of the opportunity record just like we configured the opportunity pipeline view we can also configure a kanban view click on add controls and look for kanban is in a and select it for rev and then do the same thing save and once it is safe we can click on publish so we just publish our opportunities kanban view and we are now back in our sales of application and let's go to the opportunities table and then and then we can see a kanban view the kanban view shows opportunity as cards we can change it to either business process flow or status the opportunity cards within the swim lanes shows where in the process the opportunities are i hope this guide helps you better understand opportunities and dynamics 365 sales if you found this video helpful don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos thanks for watching this video and see you next time